So it looks like season three is heavily focused around Rebirth Island. They're even going as far as saying Rebirth Day is going to be April 3rd, which is the launch of season three. So we'll go ahead and check out the trailer. So now we get the trailer. Oh, we're going to have to look back at this and see what looks different. Okay, you can use the water now. It looks like a little bit more grass. The bunkers are still there. There's an underwater part. Okay, I'm trying to see spot what difference is. Hmm. Okay, that's still usable, but you can actually use that as a zip now. So even if it's at the top, you could just glide up. Hmm. Oh, the top of prison is actually blown open. Oh! It's actually... Oh, that is so good! Alright, I had to double check. So, I'm a little confused now because when you rewind it, obviously this is, looks like a good picture of it. But we can see that the, the, the little sniper tower at the HQ uh, building adjacent is, is still up and it's not like ramped over and the building isn't destroyed. And we skim through here, there's multiple scenes that are like that where this you can see that the building is still standing. So I wonder if there's dynamic events in the, in the map that cause it to crash or at the start of some matches it's broken and other ones it's not. So it has a dynamic feel where sometimes it has certain events happening and sometimes it doesn't. Because this is actually like another POV where we can see the building is fully standing in the back here. And then uh, below, you can't really see it because of my camera, uh, but it, it still has the normal infrastructure there. Uh, where there's not a big old crater in the middle because the building fell over. Interesting. Okay, this is the side of there. This is the cool part where I think, like the zip, you get a dynamic zip here. So you can see this guy jumps on, even though the thing's not there because of the zip mechanics. You get a horizontal zip up. Obviously, you're going to be a little bit more exposed going up, but it does give you that availability to be able to jump up. If you wanted to sneak up on someone, um, is this like a, a robot like uh, skin? I don't know what the heck that is. Okay, cool. They do an execution, whatever. And what is this again? Okay, prison. That's the showers up to the door on the side uh, up there. And then the stairs right there. Okay, and you can see this. It's not exploded on the inside. So I wonder if there's an event that happens that modifies the building. Specifically right here. So it's still not broken. And then somehow an explosion happens and now you're able to drive on top of prison. That is crazy to me. Yeah, like it's clearly destroyed in an obvious way. And then this helicopter, this plane comes by and destroys the side of this. And then it obviously lands on top of prison and that uh, creates and serves as a ramp. That's crazy to me. So, huh, I wonder how this actually, this is going to be cool. Hopefully they have a blog to kind of cover those details because even right here, it's not broken. So, 
Hmm. Yeah, that, that has to be one of the most interesting parts for me is whether or not how they're going to handle this building exploding. Is that going to be mid-match? Uh, it also looks like this is uh, potentially a new sniper rifle. I'm not 100% sure. Uh, but it does definitely look like one that we don't currently have. It'll be interesting. I, I'm looking forward to some kind of blog. Hopefully we get that or a roadmap in the next day or so. And then it'll give us kind of intel. And then patch notes won't go live till about an hour before the update. So on April 3rd, there will be a patch notes style video with the detailed changes to weapons and balancing in addition to whatever they're going to change in the game, whether it's perks and those types of things. Let me know, are you more or less interested in this map now that you've seen how it looks? Maybe some potential changes that we're still a little bit unsure of? In the comments section, appreciate all the support. Thank you for watching. As always, have a great day.